What is up everybody and welcome back to my channel Fiddleland we are back with another video and today we have an unboxing y'all Today comes from none other than my fitteds The powerhouse my fitteds The one that people were actually thinking that we're going to take over Hat Club And just beat them out the water My fitteds still doing their thing but I believe still no competition for Hat Club. Hat Club is always going to be Hat Club. You feel me? By the way, I skipped out. I know. I know y'all wanted to see it. But I skipped out the Sugar Shack 2.0. Main reason, saving money. Trying to save money for the trip. Patches and Pins Expo in Chicago, August 6th. Catch me there. Say what's up to me. Um, I'm going to be vlogging. I'm going to be buying... It's going to be an experience, y'all. It's going to be an experience. I'm going to buy the VIP. I'm trying to skip the line. I know some people say it's not even worth buying it because the VIP slash skip the line ticket, you're still going to have a line. That kind of defeats the purpose. But for what I'm trying to do, I probably won't be as long, maybe, on the, on the uh, skip the line ticket. Who knows? I don't know. But I'm going to give it a try. Um, it's going to be first of many. I definitely am going to be traveling a lot more. Um, another update, my pins, my pins. I know a lot of you are expecting my pins already. They just went into production. 18 days, uh, production, five day shipping. So I can't wait to get those in. I'm doing a huge, huge thing with those pins. Out of those 50, you got to stay tuned because you don't want to miss it. I know y'all want to buy my pins, but there's a perk to buying a pin. There's a perk to buying my pins, okay? But, uh, yeah, enough talking. If you are new to my channel, make sure I subscribe, like the video, leave some comments, turn on those post notifications on so you get notified every time I drop a banger, y'all. Y'all don't want to miss my videos. We do a lot of unboxings over here. We're going to be doing vlogs soon. Listen, website coming. New, my new wave of videos are going to be coming. I just got a lot of exciting things coming. That's it. And I told y'all little by little, little by little, I'm going to keep up with y'all on it and give y'all updates. Little by little. And uh, as y'all see, my pins just went into production. So y'all got the first set of news right there. All right, let's get right into it. Boom, let's put it over here so I can take a look at it. Oh, that is clean. I like the colors on this hat right here, y'all. This is pretty dope. All right, without further ado, boom. Yeah, I know I've been heavy. Into the Bisons, this is another one. This is another one. A fire dropped by them. I think this one is inspired by Pika Pika or Pika Pika some chicken, something like that. Pika Pika, something like that. I don't know. It's inspired by this right here. All right. Very clean hat. Very clean hat. I like the colors on this. Um, Fall hat, maybe? But y'all know me. I'm going to wear this soon, probably. All right, what we got here? We got like a cream hat. It looks like a cream, yeah. Yeah, like a cream hat. This right here, the brim, is like a burgundy, like a burgundy brown almost. Burgundy brownish, I want to say. All right, we got like that fire pink on the bottom for the UV. Like a fire pink, yeah. Bisons, you get more of that fire pink. You get somewhat like a burgundy. You get rust, like a rust color in there. Uh, gold sliding bison. Very clean. By John Jay. Very clean by John Jay. For real, for real. I like that. If anybody know how to do a bison, John Jay, my fit is, they go above and beyond. Same color button as the brim. We got a flat tonal flag right there, y'all. 
All right, what we got here? Uh, again, with like that burgundish brown and pink raised batty, minor league batterman right there. I like that. White guts, seven and three eighths. My size, not your size. By the way, that's gonna be a pin. That's gonna be my next pin, y'all. Not your size, just remember that. All right, new rail flag, genuine merchandise tag, and made in Bangladesh, y'all. Not bad, not bad, not too shabby. Now y'all know I've been having bad luck with Chinas lately. I've been having bad luck with Chinas. But once I get a bang, that's what she said. I'm happy. All right, what we got here for the side patch? Is this even a side patch? What do you call this? We got the B for bison. And then of course the ball in like a curved way with like a, that's like a different color used than in the front. No, actually it does. It's like orange and then pink. Simple little side patch, nothing crazy. Pretty dope. I need a hat carrier because I believe I'm going to be going crazy at Chicago. I'm going to be buying fitteds. I'm going to be buying pins. Maybe a couple of t-shirts, vintage. Y'all know I'm into vintage. Uh, but yeah, that's why I'm saving my money, y'all. Because I know I'm probably going to be blowing a bag over there. All right. Take off these stickers. And we're going to take it to the dome piece for y'all one time. Shout out to my bison plug out there in New York. Um, I don't know if you know who you are, if you watch my videos. I think he probably does. I'm pretty sure because um, it's crazy because I don't think he knows I do YouTube. But uh, he commented on one of my videos. It is exactly the same name as his face and profile. His picture even looks like him. So if you are my bison plug, shout out to you, Chris. These stickers are on here. My fit has been kind of dropping the ball lately. These last couple uh, drops, I've heard people that live over there. Yeah, I know I got my little plugs in the hat community or whatever. But uh, a lot of people that live in New York that I know told me that they were able to do the line and go a second time around, which is crazy. Uh, but yeah, let's give this one a little curve. And we're going to take it to the dome piece, y'all. We're going to take it to the dome piece. Nice little subtle curve, nothing crazy. Hey, by the way, I can just tell this is going to look nice once I hit it with the steam. Y'all already know. All right, nice little subtle curve. Let's put her on the dome piece. Yeah. What else you got to say? What else do you got to say? You got nothing else to say. That's the fit right there, y'all. That's the fit. Man, these bison just look so clean on the dome. And I know a lot of people are not a fan of them. They don't want to fall into the hype. They think bisons are all hype. Me, I kind of fell into the hype. I purchased my first one, took it to the dome, wore it out, got compliments on that hat. So what I do, I bought two more. And what I'm going to do, and I'm going to keep on buying them. All right. So if I see a clean bison in Chicago out there, watch out. Yeah, this is clean, y'all. This I'm going to have to pull this out soon. Matter of fact, what if I wear this to Chicago? That would be crazy, too. But I got a theme. I got a theme. I'm going to go with a lot of cubs in hand. Plain and simple. Probably take three to four cubbies. One to just rock a different one, not a cubbies. I got to buy a little hat carrier from Hat Club before I leave. I know Lids got them. Call me a hype beast, but I think the Hat Club one look better. So I got to order one. There y'all go. Y'all wanted exciting news? I told you my pins went into production. Here this week, I'm going to be talking to the person that's going to be helping me out with my new series of videos. When I tell you this, y'all don't want to miss it. Y'all do not want to miss it. I'm about to take the fitted world by storm. Very different. Very different website coming soon. And guess what? I'm doing this all by myself, y'all. Mastermind by myself. Stay thinking. You, your mind, 
can't control your future just by thinking. All right, but don't don't overthink too much. Don't overthink too much, y'all. But yeah, let me know what y'all think. Let me know how I did. Appreciate all of y'all that comes in and support my videos in and out. It means a lot. Stay positive and good vibes as always. I'll catch you on the next one. Have a good one, y'all.